been excellent. Really, uh, really good opportunity to come out to um, to Spain, to especially the the Basque country, um, and to experience um, the the methodologies and uh, the understand the methodologies of not only um, the athletic Bilbao but also um, feeder clubs and, and some some of the smaller clubs as well. We spent the day athletic um, athletic Bilbao, the um, the, the training centre, the academy. Um, and we had an insight into their methodology as an academy and um, the, we had the opportunity to watch training sessions at different age groups. Um, I think the biggest thing that, that came out of that f for me was the, their strength of identity and, and their values and, and, and how they live by those on a day-to-day -day -day basis, uh, basis. And I think that's sort of, um, on a bigger scale, it is the Basque um, uh, culture. One of the clubs which doesn't have a first team, uh, it's just solely academy up to under 19 and their whole purpose is to, to develop these young boys to, to go on to a, a professional career and, and, and hopefully in, in, in athletics. So really impressive in terms of how they um, uh, try and develop their players, the resources and the effort that they put into that and it was, a, it was really impressive to see it's ultimately a grassroots club and how, how professional they went about their business and, and they had a clear methodology, clear identity and a clear plan of how they wanted to, um, to go, around their, uh, go about their day-to-day -day business to be able to try and produce these young, um, young aspiring professional footballers. But again, um, doing it all, all the time with developing the, 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 the young boy, the person as well as, as, the, as the footballer. Just when speaking to, um, to coaches or, or just just general sort of public, they, they go into quite a lot of detail in terms of tactics of the game. So there's definitely a cultural thing, uh, and then I, I think uh, technique is is is, um, is a given as well. I think that te technically, looking at sort of even the grassroots teams, nearly all the players are very comfortable on the ball and they look quite um, cultured on the ball as well. So um, they, they're something that I think. Is, is a cultural thing, but you can you can definitely see it w w in the um, in in the players and in the academies that we visited so far. There's there's so much to um, to see and hear and learn from um, here, um, but I think that that applies to to any any sort of study visit you've got. And you can there's always something that uh, you should be able to sort of take away and, and learn from. Um, but, especially here in Spain, um, you know, they, they've got a history of developing top players uh, and they've been very, very successful in, in, the, near, in, the, sort of in, in the past. Of, you know, they've won a few football cups and the European Cups um, not so long ago, so um, there's definitely lots to learn um, when you come and visit these, you know, th th these clubs uh, and the Spanish clubs. Um, and yeah, I'd definitely recommend it for, for anyone who's, uh, who's aspiring to, to improve and develop as a, as a coach.